I like all the good wives that's in domestic love relationships and shit. And um, you done some domestic love type activities. But then when your ass in court, when you're in court, you get surprised because of what the judge say, because you like, I didn't even much go that far. I, I didn't mean to do that shit. Like, how's y'all going to charge me with that? Y'all got to see something. Listen, this was back in, I think, 2019. But I just saw it the other day. And I'm like, wow, that's really messed up. Say, really, Willie, thank you for schooling the young man that, that, that a preacher is no different than a pimp. Boston in the building. The monkey is the best in the morning time. I'm trying to tell you something. Y'all got to watch this here. I appreciate that. This is in 2019, I think. Assault after running over her husband learns in court today that her husband has died from his injuries and now she's charged with murder. As you will see, it shocked her and stunned those who know Toya Mathis. WLKY's Ann Bowden has more from the scene. Well, as you can see behind me, Louisville Metro Police have returned to the scene of the crime here in the parking lot outside of Incredible Days since this has now become a murder case. All of this started. Monday night. Everybody loved Toya. Yeah, yeah. She, I mean, she's a wonderful person. Yeah. Miss Mathis, on case number 58, you're charged with uh, assault in the first degree, domestic violence, uh, Thaddeus Thomas, and then on case number 59, it looks like the charge has been upgraded to murder, domestic violence. Bond on both of these has been set at a half a million dollars. Obviously shocked, 28-year-old Toya Mathis learns in court that her husband, 31-year-old Thaddeus Thomas, is dead and she's now charged with murder. Police say on Monday, Mathis and her husband got into a verbal argument in this parking lot on Westport Road. That's when police say Mathis got into her Dodge Charger and intentionally hit Thomas. The impact sent him five to ten feet in the air. Emergency crews rushed him to University Hospital, and on Tuesday, he died. I've been shaking ever since I heard him. You know, this is not her. not her. I'm a senior in the neighborhood. I told you to bake me uh, brownies, you know, uh, it's a Thanksgiving dinner, I mean, She's come, come, yeah, come, come down and get, and get, you, get you a plate. Neighbors say Mathis lived in the area for two years after moving from a previous violent relationship. They said she and Thomas became a part of the neighborhood with her mother and son. Mathis is also eight months pregnant. Her only record, a speeding ticket eight years ago. I don't know what happened there, so I can't speak of it, but I will put my hand to Jesus to say that I know that's not Toya. Friends of Toya Mathis say they are praying for Toya, they're praying for her family and for the family of Thaddeus Thomas. Right now, Toya remains in jail at Metro Corrections on a half million dollar bond. Here outside of the Rolling Hills Shopping Center, Ann Bowden, WLKY News. Thank you, Ann. WLKY tried to contact family members of Thaddeus Thomas, but we were not able to reach them. Toya Mathis is scheduled to be back in court later this month. She's in court today that her husband. Wow. Oh. She ain't mean to. That baby ain't mean to. I don't know for what. Listen, y'all can't charge her with murder. <laughs> they was. That wasn't her intentions. She was in a domestic love situation and did what anybody in a domestic love situation is supposed to do. Damn right you run your hub and all. That's, what did That's real love. That's why the expression on her face, man, this that bullshit. Free, free, free toy. Okay, all of this started Monday night. Everybody loved Toya. Yeah, yeah. She, I mean, she's a wonderful person. Yeah. She looked like she's a wonderful person, though, like, out of the community. And shout that baby out because you do got a real in, you know what I'm saying? Miss Mathis, on case number 58, you're charged with uh, assault in the first degree, domestic violence. You see that? She okay with that. Assault, first degree, domestic, you know what I'm saying? I, all right, she hit petty. I still got my man, you know what I'm saying? That's nothing. Uh, Thaddeus Thomas, and then on case number 59, it looks like the charge has been upgraded to murder, domestic violence, bond on both of these. That's genuine. 
that 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 that's that's genuine hurt. She loved that man. She loved that man with everything she got. Look at that face. This is the type of face that you want yo 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 your wife or your la 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 to have when you done perished. That's love. We got 87 thumbs up. Oh, I know we can do better than these thumbs up. Come on now, we got to get thumbs up over 100. I'm just saying. That face is like, all I did was run them over. The f fuck you mean murder? Looks like the charge has been upgraded to murder, domestic violence. Bottom. Look, look, look. The way, listen. Facial expression and shit, bot body language she couldn't even hide that up because that wasn't her intentions and this is why i talk domestic love is real love domestic love relationships is real love out here she just ran them over go ahead on get locked up they're gonna give me a bun i'm a bun out this shit nothing we're gonna get right back together and take care of these goddamn churn you know what i'm saying but y'all be so quick to break up because you done got ran over by a car and shit that sucker shit you know what i'm saying Baby, hood. Both of these has been set at a half. Look how her eyes bucked over this shit. What the fuck he me? He dead? Oh, hell no. Let me call my mama now. You know what I'm saying? I don't believe it. Goddamn, I got to talk to my mama. Gonna pray for it. million dollars. Obviously shocked. 28 year old Toya Mathis learns in court that her husband, 31 year old Thaddeus Thomas, is dead. And she's now charged with murder. Police say on Monday, Mathis and her husband got into a verbal argument in this parking lot on Westport Road. That's when police say Mathis got into her Dodge Charger and intentionally hit Thomas. The impact sent him five to ten feet in the air. I, nah, I think I remember doing doing this story. Now that I'm thinking about it, you say you never know what couples go through behind closed doors. I'm trying to tell you, it's, damn it, we be in love. <laughs> Emergency crews rushed him to university. DJ, I see you. It's been, it's been a while. Where you been? City Hospital. And on Tuesday, he died. I've been shaking ever since I heard it. You know, it's, it's, it's... And she good people, though. She look like good people. You know what I'm saying? Not her. Not her. I'm a senior in, in the neighborhood. I told you to bake me uh, brownies, you know. Uh, Miss Caroline, listen. She didn't want her face to be shown. But what's strange, they put a whole name up there. Everybody in the community know who Miss Carolina Caroline is. Her nails is freshly did, though. You know what I'm saying? Thanksgiving, Jan. I mean, She's come, come, yeah, come, come down and get, and get, you, get you a plate. Neighbors say Mathis lived in the area for two years after moving from a previous violent relationship. They said she and Thomas became a part of the neighborhood with her mother and son. Mathis is also eight months pregnant. She was in the previous domestic love relationship and then decided to go on and separate that right out. I told y'all about separating from the domestic love situation. Shit don't never go right after you go on and leave and try to change your damn life. Fuck all that right there. Damn it, deal with what you signed up for. But then she got into another domestic love relationship according to the, the shit that she had done did and that's why she is behind bars now. She moved with it. Move, relocated with her baby them at her mama them house. So she chose the player who, when they moved, they did not immediately have a place to live at. That's who she gave her coochie to. But she loved them. You know what I'm saying? Because they hub and their wife and all that shit. They got married without a place to stay. All right, cute. As long as you together as a unit. We have to support family ships around here. But then you got peed in and going to keep the goddamn baby. Eight months pregnant. Who's the daddy? Hell, it might have been the last domestic look. Well, no, no, I'm not going to put that on Toya because Toya good people. You know what I'm saying? She was just having sex with her husband because she had to marry him with her husband. Got peed in and kept the baby. Living with her mama now. Keep doing what you're doing. Y'all make the best decisions for yourself, especially with picking dingalings. Out here on earth, I really ain't tripping on that. Do the best that you can with what you got Um, when you choose to just pick a player and not a true player out here on earth because you didn't put your application in. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
Got to pray, pray for the family. Thaddeus them. Because he gone. Zach.